Hi and welcome back. In this video, I will show you how to change the background color of any section on your Shopify store, like for example, this section right here. And uh, you can choose any color that you want. And yeah, there's two ways to do it. One might be better for you than the other, but yeah. So let's get right started by heading over to Shopify. So we're gonna click on online store right here. And under themes, we can just click on customize. And then uh, over here, I'm gonna have to add a section first, uh, or actually we can just use this featured product section right here. So let's just use this one. You can use any section as far as I know. The first way of doing it, and this might be the worst way, is to go over here where it says color scheme. And you can change the color here to, for example, accent one or two or whatever you want, for example, background two. And uh, well, you can go over here to theme settings in order to change the color of that uh, background two is I think what I chose. So we can just click in here and change that color. Yep, and there we go. That's how you change the color. Now, the other way is uh, we'll have to go back over to sections. And now we scroll down over here all the way and click on custom CSS right here. If you want to change only this section and not all of the sections that use the background to color scheme, we can just uh, type in here diff like so, and then uh, this um, and uh, use these brackets right here. And then you want to type in background color like so, and then a column. And then you would uh, just type in your color, for example, red, or let's uh, use blue so you can see it changing. There we go, it just changed. And instead of this uh, color, you can also just um, paste in a hex code. For example, if you, oops, if you wanted red, you could use this hex code. And you can just uh, search up on the internet to find a hex code for the color that you want. Or you can, of course, just use your um, brand colors if you have ones. Okay, so there we go. That's how you do it. Don't forget to hit on save. And that's how you change it. And as you can see, once I refresh, it's also showing on here.